Time to go, Ponskalev. You want to stay here and touch me? Yes, you may. Dead man walking. That's as far as you go, sister. Any last words, Ponsler? Yes, sir, I do. Mr. Delcroix, I don't want to leave this world with any hate in my heart. Or I ask your forgiveness for what I've done. It was a terrible thing I've done, taking your son away from you. <laughs> Mr. Mrs. Percy, I hope my death gives you some relief. I just want to say, I think killing is wrong, no matter who does it, whether it's me or y'all or your government.
The death penalty debate heated up last week thanks to a new study that said the chemicals used in lethal injection may not properly sedate and painlessly kill an inmate. The study says it could cause enormous pain in convicts as they consciously suffocate to death. Eleven states have temporarily banned the process, including in Tennessee, where convicted cop killer Philip Workman is just days from execution. CNN.com's Ashley Fence has this report. Three times Tennessee death row prisoner Philip Workman has come within hours of being lethally injected before court stepped in to spare his life. But on May 9th, it appears likely Workman will pay the ultimate price for killing a police officer during a 1981 botched armed robbery. The 53-year-old isn't scared to die, but he's very frightened about what it will feel like. It almost makes me want to choose electric chair because Lisa probably get knocked unconscious. Researchers at the University of Miami studied drugs used in California and North Carolina executions, as well as post-mortem and eyewitness accounts. They found that lethal injections may not sedate an inmate and kill them quickly, and could cause a slow and excruciating death, all while a prisoner is awake but unable to move. They're saying in this report that a lot of them have suffered but wasn't able to speak because that's what happens, that second concoction of poison or whatever it is they shoot into you paralyzes you. You can't move, you can't speak. So if you're feeling pain or whatever you're feeling, especially when they shoot that third concoction in there, it's supposed to then stop your heart, you can't move to tell it or to say anything. 